Hey guys, welcome to Testing Academy. My name is Pramod and welcome to the 30 days API testing challenge. And this is the day 26 and we are going to discuss today about the demo sites for API testing. Like guys, uh, means uh, in the past also I had this kind of a problem where I'm not able to find the sites which can provide me some dummy APIs so that I was, I can able to create the CRUD operation, play around with the test cases and all right. So I have uh, basically collected all the websites. Uh, these are some of them are demo websites and few of them are real websites. Also an API directory that definitely can help you to perform the API testing over these uh, these websites. All right. So I hope you are excited. So let's get started guys. All right. So if you want to uh, download all the resources, you can go to the scrolltest.com slash API slash ask, right? And if you want to basically check out the thread in the club.ministry uh, of testing.com, you can go to day 26 of it. If you want to download all the resources related to 30 days API testing challenge, I will recommend you to go to api testing.co slash 30 days, 30 days, right? So uh, before we start, I just wanted to get, uh, tell you guys that uh, we are on a mission to basically master the API testing and this challenge has changed my life and definitely can help you to change also. If you haven't watched the previous video, I will highly recommend to go watch it out. Uh, there is a link somewhere and that can definitely help you a lot because in this day 26, we have learned a lot. Of, uh, we, we have learned about Postman, Rest Assured, few of the concepts about the GitHub repo APIs and all right. So definitely guys, I will recommend you to watch it out. Right. So uh, these are the five websites which I was talking about. This is the REQRES, basically request response short form dot in stpp dot org, a dummy to rest, uh, dummy site and JSON placeholder, right? So let me open it and uh, show you how this is, looks like. So this is a REQRES, which is a short form of request response. Uh, it is about a users where basically what you can do is that you can play around with the different STPP methods. Uh, it contains get all users, single user, CRUD, post, put, back, basically updating a user, creating a user, deleting a particular user, right? So this is very helpful. Also, it can help you to basically a different response code, uh, registration unsuccessful, a post call, uh, definitely a success post call. So you can play around and basically add it to your Postman collection and create an API, API testing to, uh, suite in that case, right? Uh, second website, which is most important one, I will recommend you to go through it. Uh, this is stppbin.org. It will provide, it provides lots of different stpp methods like uh, delete, get, patch, post, basically a full CRUD that you can play around. You can click on here, try it, and uh, click on execute. And if it, after executing, basically it will give you a CRUD, a curl request that you can import to a postman, right? So uh, if you haven't watched my previous tutorial, how to import it, there is an import button in the postman. Go to raw text and paste this curl, and you will have created uh, you know, this or uh, this uh, request will be imported to your postman in that case. So I will recommend you to watch or uh, to try out other uh, API endpoints related to some for different formats and all. Right, uh, dummy sample API. It's again very similar to the re request response one, where we are talking about the employees, creation of the employees, getting employed, updation of an employee. Uh, structure and uh, deletion of a particular employee ID, right? Based on that, right? Uh, similarly, we have JSON placeholder, like most of the people use it. Uh, most of the examples that you will see online, they will include this resource. Uh, basically, it's uh, about the JSON placeholder. It's all about the post, again, same CRUD operations, and it's based on the uh, post, basically post ID, whenever you post something, right? It's a kind of a blog, <laughs> right? All right, so these were some of the uh, demo websites and uh, let's move on to the real one. And one of the uh, link that I have missed is fake uh, Azure websites, very, very similar to the uh, JSON placeholder, right? Uh, if you want to play around with that real one, go to github.com, create an account and play around with the GitHub repo APIs, guys. Right? This is one of the free or you can say most interesting uh, API testing that you can do. There are lots of keys, lots of things that you can play around. If you have watched my JSON, JSON schema validation and all, there are lots of things that you can play around with minimum properties and all. Lots of related, lots of test cases that you can automate basically, I mean to say in that thing, right? So you can write for uh, STPP codes, uh, 
lots of keys, chain request chaining, all the things that I have taught you in the previous videos. This for this API, you can play around. Uh, it is interesting one, and also I have created one video about how to uh, basically work with CRUD operation GitHub repo API with Postman. You can check it out on uh, YouTube channel, right? And so the most important one, which is uh, API directory, I'm giving you API full API directory for API testing. Uh, these are the lots of links related to it. For example, Google Maps API, Twitter API, YouTube API, Flickr API, Facebook API. You can create and sign up a particular account and definitely you can play around with the, these kind of APIs. These APIs will have auth, auth1, auth2. Basically, you will learn about it. Basic auth, bearer token, JWT token, all these concepts that I have discussed in the previous videos, you can implement into the API testing with these APIs. I'll recommend you to start automating it and create a Postman collection around it, right? Uh, I hope you have learned something in this video. So that's all about it. And this would like this this link, especially this one. Last one is the most important one. Trust me, guys. And I hope you have learned something something new. Thanks a lot for watching. And if you have any question, comment down below. I will be happy to help. And uh, thanks a lot for watching till now. And uh, trust me, guys. If means this a challenge has changed my life and definitely can change yours. Uh, mark my words, and you will learn a lot in this channel. So if you haven't watched the previous video, go watch it and. Uh, try out uh, some other video related to Postman on my playlist section, guys. Right? Uh, if you want to learn the advanced stuff, go to learnapitesting.com. You will learn more advanced testing concepts or apitesting.co for full mastering the API testing. Right? Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next day.